Dear viewers to the show, it's only the start of 2012 but already coast to coast we hear reports that humanity has evolved globally now that we know the cause of all our woes, Joseph Coney! The world's now on a better path and the panacea seems to have come from this hero white man here! Whose internet video played a vital role in highlighting the plight of Uganda's child soldiers. It went viral and spread with unprecedented speed, shared over Twitter feeds and endorsed by celebrities. To tell us more, we're happy to have him on. It's General Baxter, representing AFRICOM. General Baxter, good to see you. Right back at ya. Tell us, what does all this signify for Africa? Well, Robert, I can tell you for a start. Kony 2012 really made me appreciate art. When my son showed me this clip, my heart was stirred. I was spurred to action to right the wrong that occurred. Tell us your feelings, General. Be honest. Since we killed Osama, there's been a hole in my stomach. Sorry to hear that. I miss him. Why? Because we desperately need a new dark-skinned Disney villain so we can justify defense budgets of trillions in a never-ending quest to kill him. And this time, it's African soil where we need to get him broiled and quick before China gets all the oil. So this Kony is a perfect gift, then. He looks like a bad guy and he hurts children. Kony 2012 was an experiment. Was it a success? Yes. Kids are begging the US to bomb Africa next. Check this out. Let me introduce you to Gavin, my son. Gavin, what does daddy do? Kill poor people with guns. Yeah. Now look what happens when I show Gavin a picture of an African. Who's this? That's a bad guy. That's right. And what do we do to bad guys? We use drones and armed forces to kill them and take their resources. Yeah, see Robert? Even a four-year-old has got it. This makes me so proud. I'm sorry. The video's done more than you ever envisaged, and in 27 minutes, without cats or titties. We used to have to wait for terrorist attacks to justify interventions and mineral grabs. Now, thanks to viral videos, we can send advisors to lynch, I mean arrest, black, I mean bad guys. And what will you do once they've been caught? Hand them over to the International Criminal Court. You mean the same court which the US refuses to submit to for its own war crimes and abuses? Is that hypocrisy? <laughs> Robert, honestly, the ICC only prosecutes dark people's atrocities. Okay, I hear there's been criticism of the video's accuracy, fallacies, and neo-colonial fantasies. Don't have such a heart of darkness, Robert. Join the missionary industrial complex. Save poor Africa from burning. Accept the white man's burden. Plus, 90 million Americans now know that Africa exists. That's good, no? I suppose so. All right, General Baxter, thanks for appearing tonight to explain the facts in black and, well, mostly white. Some might disagree with this call to make Kony famous, but what we've witnessed this week is nevertheless momentous. A demonstration of this internet's potential abilities to instantly inform and engage tens of millions, and a willingness of those millions of people to engage passionately with something more meaningful. Combined, these are promising signs of the potential energy that lies dormant and primed, ready to rise when the moment arrives. What that moment will be, we shall see in time.